Hey coach, uh, welcome. I'm glad you found us on YouTube. A couple things. First of all, make sure you subscribe and like. That's super important. Um, also go over and make, a, make sure you check out teachhoops.com for coaches who want to get better. Uh, you know, a lot, of, a lot of state championships, a lot of national championships. Let me help you become a better basketball coach. Go over and check us out at teachhoops.com. Remember to subscribe. Enjoy the video. All right, next drill is five by four. Now this is a, this is a great drill. One of my assistant coaches showed this to me probably about 10 years ago, and, uh, and we've been running it pretty consistently since. Um, <clears throat> there's, five, there's five moves, five moves, four shots at, of uh, each move, okay? And then there's, there's four different locations. So Augustine wants you rebound, okay? Ben will be here on a wing. Drew over there on a wing. So it's four guys. All you need is four to do this. <clears throat> You need, uh, you need a ball. Ben, you need to go get a ball. <laughs> and what it does is it, everybody has a job. And what, what, why I like this shooting, you know, a lot of shooting drills, people are stationary. They're just rebounding. They're not doing a lot. You know, Augustine's rebounding, but the other three guys are pretty active and they're moving. They're doing something at all times. And that's why I like this drill. Um, so what's going to happen is the, the postman is going to do five different moves. Okay, the first move is just a basic drop step. He's going to drop down, shoulder parallel to the backboard, and do the layup. Okay, so Ben's going to make the pass in here. Okay, he's going to drop step. Hold on, go nice and slow. He does his drop step. As soon as he makes the pass, he runs the half court, touches it with his foot, and comes back to the wing. Okay, now, then we go, then he goes the other side. Same thing. Drop step, nope, you go to the baseline this time. Okay, so rather than going half court, this guy goes to the baseline, we change it up a little bit, and then he goes here. That's his second shot, then he's gonna do two more shots. Keep going. And the rebounder's just kicking it out to him. And then up top. All right, so a couple points of emphasis with this that we talk about with our guys, is make sure you're posting up high enough, staying wide, we'll kind of talk about that in a little bit. Um, but we got to make sure they'll take shortcuts on this drill. They won't sprint to half court. Um, they'll just kind of jog. You really got to get on them initially when you do this drill that they're working and sprinting, touching the baseline with their feet. Okay, so the first move is um, the power slide. All right, power slide. Next one is going to be up and under. Or actually, let's do baby hook next. So baby hook next. And I let them go to their strong hand. This is kind of a little bit of a loss. Yep, all the way up. Good. Keep going. Do the other two moves. And what's nice about this drill is if you have more kids, what do you do? You put a defender on the post. You put a defender on the wing. All right. Was that all your moves? All right. So you do, you do four shots. Okay. And then like I was saying, I could put a defender here. Okay. If I got an extra kid, I could put a defender here. I can put an extra rebounder. I can put a defender over there to make it harder. So if you have more kids, you can do those things. That's, that, that's an easy adjustment. All right, next one is going to be up and under. You know, I, when I grew up, this was a Jack Sigma move. All right, keep that ball nice and high. Post up really high, up and under. And if they, you know, we always kind of end practice with this drill at times. And it's, and it's good from the sense that, you know, they're getting a lot of shots. Uh, they're moving. Next one is going to be elbow shot. Squaring up, just shooting. And you can change this if you want to do a wing shot, you want to do a short corner. Okay. And like I was saying before, what I like is you can change the shots. You can change where the defenders are. You can change uh, all that stuff. We just call it five by four because there's four positions and five shots. All right, last one is going to be elbow and hard drive to the basket. Go. Good. Square up. Get those feet squared. Good. Square it up. Hard drive. Good. And notice how he's squaring up and attacking the rim. All right, good. <clears throat> that drill, lots of shots, short period of time, everyone's active, um, and you can change the types of shots that you need to do. Easy, easy adjustment to, to that drill. Um, but, you know, it's, it's one where everyone's a little bit active. 
as soon as you have more kids, you can do work on your defensive aspect in that drill. You, you, like I said, you put maybe if I usually if I have only one extra kid, I put them in the post. So you work on post defense. We can work on harassing. The wings are my secondary worry as far as defense. So if you only have five kids, you put one on the post, and that makes it an easy adjustment. Hey, coach! So happy you're enjoying the video. Make sure you like the video down below. That's awesome. That helps us a ton. And also make sure you subscribe. Hit that little bell for notifications and go over and check out teachhoops.com for coaches who want to get better.